going back home. Remember the dresser that the you dresser. She was out? impressed. Yeah. She was like, oh my He God. threw a big old dresser on his shoulders and carried it out of the lady's house. <laughs> she was like, whoa. These palm trees. Beautiful, huh? Imagine if we went there and the house was in the sinkhole. There was no house there. Oh in. my gosh. Yeah, because we're in the neighborhood now where the sinkhole swallowed the guy that was sleeping in his bed and the other family members were on the other side of the house. Um, and they never found him. And they just recently, I think last year or the year before, closed in his house. Or closed in the sinkhole and took the rest of the house out. Um, they never found him. But yeah, we're in that neighborhood now. That's where we live. Yep. I'm bringing the grass. It just feels so weird coming in here now. Yeah. Look, jeez. Because the butterflies in the Uh-huh. So that's where I met my love. neighborhood you're supposed to keep your grass at a certain height your trees have to be trimmed up and above uh, off the sidewalk area they still have our palm trees out there and our aloe and our rose bushes wow so yeah that's where we lived our first house together Not taken care of at all. There was our neighbors. We were friends with them. Yep. He eats cats and dogs. Yep. They eat cats and dogs. This is crazy. Go down to the park. Yep. We would just walk down to the park. It's weird that it looks so nasty in a neighborhood like this that the house looks that way. That's the only house that looks that way. That is so crazy. Well, that one. Remember when somebody got into a fight over here and graffitied that house? Yeah. Um, a, a mad girlfriend or something. She she graffitied the garage. No. We used to walk down here with the kids. Rodney Colson Park. And sometimes, oh, they took that. Um, there was like a, a mobile home over here that was like the uh, park keeper stayed in, but they took that out. That's nice and green now. Yeah. Wow. It's old park down here cleaning it up now. They're looking at us like, why y'all here? <laughs> wow. That's crazy. And the old park's still the same. Nothing's changed about it. You know where we're at? You guys really don't know where we're at? This park doesn't look familiar to you? Serious button. You don't remember coming to this park? Was you not paying attention to the whole driving we just did? Nope. We just went by the old house. <laughs> remember the old house? You were on your phone? You remember the old house? Brenton's totally clueless right now because he was on his phone. He don't even know what's going on. <coughs> and the <coughs> Keely and Jace was sleeping, but anyways, we're in our old neighborhood and at the old park. Junior's just taking a cigarette break. Oh, there 
There you go, guys. That was a view of our old neighborhood. Feels weird to be back. Yep. I don't want to go back up north. Yeah, me either. But unfortunately, we have to for now. But we'll be back. For now. We're good. But we'll be moving back. So anyways, just wanted to show you guys a little sneak peek of our vacation video that will be coming very soon. Thanks. Okay. Guys, so we're in the neighborhood of where that house fell in, the sinkhole, and reopened two years later in um, Sufner, Florida. It was a neighborhood over from ours. Look, his little gravestone. I don't even want to walk right here because it's making me creep like I'm going to fall in. Let me get out of here. But there's his gravestone. He fell, it, he, he, I'll put the little thing that tells you what happened, but that fenced in area back there is where his house sat and it caved in and then it reopened two years after on the date. So there you go. Sinkhole, Zephyr, Florida.